Hi class! In this video, I'm going to go through how to find your reports for the reviews and homework assignments in Alex. The report will show you the score for the assignment, the current score that you have, and it will also show you a breakdown of which problems you missed, which problems were marked incorrectly, along with the appropriate answers. So let's go ahead and get started. There's a couple different places where you can view your grades and you can view your reports in Alex. The first place is the gradebook. So when you go into the gradebook in Alex, you're going to see a quick snapshot of your scores. So here you can see for my topic two review, I got a 92%. For my topic one review, I got 100%. Here in this view, all I can do is I can see the score with the assignment. I can see which assignments are completed, which ones still need to be completed, along with their due dates. This is the gradebook view. This view does not allow you to go into the assignment and view the report from this view. So let's go to a different view. So if we go back to the Alex menu and we go to Assignments instead of Gradebook. Here in Assignments, you can also see each assignment along with the current score and you can also access the report from this page. So here, again, I have my reviews, I have their score, I have my Topic 3 homework score, and then if I keep scrolling, I can find my Topic 1 homework scores. When you're viewing the assignments like this, you can click on the score and it will open a report of the assignment. If you click on the title of the assignment, you can go in and reattempt it if that assignment is still open. If you click on the score, you can view your report. So let's start by viewing the reports on reviews and then we'll go talk about how to view reports on the homework assignments. So let's say I wanted to review my report of this topic to review. I got a 92% on it. I want to look at my attempt, see the problems, and then take notes so I can retake it. So I click on the 92%. This will open my report. The report will automatically open on your highest scored attempt. So the highest score I have out of all attempts in this review is 92%. Here I can see all of the problems. I can see which problems were marked correct and which problems were incorrect. So I can see that number four, I got it partially correct. So I can go to number four. It will show me the problem I had. It'll show me the answer I submitted and the correct answer below. And then if you go to the right and you click on the eyeglasses, you can find an explanation for that problem. And then you can go through, read the explanation, reattempt the problem, and then when you feel ready, you can go and reattempt that review. You can also access the previous attempts, so if you want to get more practice with different problems. So this is my highest scored attempt, it's my second attempt, but I do have the first attempt here as well, so I could go into that first attempt. It's going to open up the problems for my first attempt, and then I could go back in and I could look at these problems, view their explanations, and help me prepare for my retake. And then below here in this view, you can go retake immediately, or you can go back to the assignment list, which is the assignment tab. So let's go ahead and go back to the assignment tab. Here on the assignment tab, this is where you can view the assignment along with the score, and you can click on it like we just did to view that review. Now let's go in and let's view a report of one of the homework assignments. So I'm going to go down to the bottom, and I'm going to look at topic two homework, because that is the one that was due and is past due. So let's go ahead and look at it. So again, I click on the score. When you click on the score for the homework, it's going to open up this view of all of the homework assignments in one. I have my topic two homework tile highlighted here, so I am looking at my topic two homework. I can though, from this view, I can click to any topic I want and view the problems in that topic for that homework. So in this topic two homework, I can see my score. I can see how many topics I completed out of the total. It tells me how, I ha how many I have remaining. And then if I go down, I can see a list of the topics here. So the ready to learn topics, I have 17. I could go to any of them from this view. And then here I can review the ones I've learned, review the ones I've mastered. And then these locked ones, these ones have to be completed after I've done the appropriate ready to learn ones. They're locked by a prerequisite topic, so you got to make sure you do the ones in ready to learn before you can do the locked topics. So from here, I could go in and I could start working on my topic two homework, or I could start working on my topic three homework. I could start working on those topics from here in this view. 
Now, let's say I was working on the topic two homework, and I remember I was working on it a long time today, and there was a problem that was really hard. I don't remember the problem, but I remember working on it today. Let's go find that problem so we can send it to our professor and get help. If you go back to your Alex menu, now go to Reports. Under Reports, you're going to have various different reports that you can view that will break down all of the work you've completed in Alex. So you can see your big Alex pie, that's what we just viewed. You can see your list of assignments. And then if you scroll down below, you can see this week's pie activity. This is where you want to go if you remember when you were working on the problem, but you don't remember what the problem was. So if I go to this week's pie activity and I click on View Full Report, here I can see here's the stuff I was working on today. So here's my little bar. I spent 32 minutes. I learned three. I attempted two, but not learned. So the problem I was struggling with is in those attempted, not learned. So if I click on this, it's going to open up a detailed list of everything I did. So I can go in here and I can see, ha, ah, at 1.22 p.m., I worked on this one. I missed it five different times. This is probably the problem I'm having trouble with. Or maybe it's the one I worked on at 1.24 p.m. I missed it twice in a row, so it could be this problem. This can help you identify what the problem is, and then once you have that title, you can go back into the homework and you can find that specific topic, you can find an example of the problem, and then you can use that to get help. You can work on that with your tutor or you can ask your professor about it. But this is where you can go to see which ones are the ones you are struggling with and at which time. And this is only going to show you the work you did on the homework. This is not going to break down the time you spent on the review. This will only break down the time and attempts you did on the homework problems. So remember to go back to that assignment list if you want to look at your reviews. So let's do a quick recap. So there's three different places you can view your grades. You can view your grades under the gradebook, under assignments, or you can go to reports and go to assignments through reports. Remember, the gradebook does not allow you to view the reports. So if you actually want to see how you did on the assignment, which problems you missed, which ones you got right, make sure you go under assignments and click on the score or go under reports and look at that breakdown of your time and topic report. All right, I hope this helps. Let me know if you have any questions.